A nonprofit is using education and community service as a weapon to make an impact on young teenage boys. A local woman is leading the charge. Randall Newsom joins us with the story about the Bloom Project. That's right, guys. Arnetta Suggs, she's the person behind this, and to her, it's more than just an organization. She says it's her calling, helping young kids find their way into adulthood, showing them how bright their futures can be. Arnetta Scruggs is carrying out a legacy of service, a mission she believes her grandfather left behind when he died. They call it the Bloom Project. Treshawn Jones, a junior at Pike High School, has been a part of the program ever since it started. I feel like the exposure. Exposure to college, careers, access to the tools that will help him build a future. But for Treshawn, it's even more than that. Family. That's like my second mom, you know. She knows when something's wrong with me, you know doing good when I'm doing bad. There's times where it's hard, especially running an all mills organization. That's when having a team comes in handy. And I'm attracted to the people that have that passion. I mean, she definitely has that passion. After seeing what the Bloom Project can do, Brandon Randall went from volunteer to being a program director. He says the most important thing about being a leader isn't always doing the talking. We're going to listen to you. And we want to know, like, what are your skills? Like, what really makes you smile? What makes you cry? and letting parents know that it's okay to need some extra help. It's okay. It's not that you're a bad parent mm -hmm. at all. He just has to find his way. They believe the best way to fight negative stereotypes their young kids will face is to reinforce a positive one, a name, a title, Kings. It's all about teaching them about how to become a king. Giving them the confidence to bloom into the leaders of tomorrow a support system to help them create their dreams and then chase them. Makes me go even harder. Not just for themselves, they're becoming examples to the ones that will come after them. I feel like if I didn't have Bloom Project, I wouldn't be the person I am today. Now, they did tell me that the Bloom Project is in need of volunteers, especially mentors. If you'd like to get involved, you can visit our website for more information. Back to you guys. All right.